Blend the spices, a flavorful journey in English learning. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, blend the spices. This phrase isn't just about cooking. It's a great way to understand how English can be as varied and colorful as a mix of spices. Let's dive in and uncover the layers of meaning behind this fascinating phrase. Blend the spices literally refers to the act of mixing various spices together. In cooking, this is done to create a harmonious flavor. But in English, this phrase can be a metaphor for combining different elements to create something unique or to enhance something's quality. It's about mixing different ideas, cultures, or characteristics. This phrase can be used in different contexts. For example, in a business setting, blend the spices might mean to combine diverse skills and perspectives in a team. In a social context, it could refer to blending various cultural traditions in a celebration. Understanding this phrase helps in grasping the beauty of English, where words can have both literal and figurative meanings. Let's see how blend the spices can be used in sentences. 1. The new project team really knows how to blend the spices, bringing in innovative ideas from different fields. 2. Our community event will blend the spices of various cultures to celebrate diversity. 3. Good literature blends the spices of language, style, and imagination. Now, let's practice. Think of a situation in your life where you have blended the spices. It could be a project, a personal experience, or even a recipe you've tried. Describe this experience using the phrase, blend the spices, and see how it enhances your English expression. Thank you for joining me today. I hope this video has added some flavor to your English learning journey. Remember, languages are like a tapestry of words and phrases, each with its unique shade and texture. Keep blending your linguistic spices and see how colorful your English can become. See you in our next video.